Kogi State Governor Yahaya Bello receives a delegation of investors from the state of Delaware, the United States of America, who are in the state to partner with the government to build a pharmaceutical company. The pharmaceutical company, CVAD, which will supply products to other states of the Federation, will be established in Kogi State owing to its strategic location, security and manpower, according to the founder of the company, Lindsay Davis. The CEO discloses plans to the governor at the government house Lokoja Ari Potter has more. The cash flow consultant Thomas Grant describes Cyvad as a capacity pharmaceutical company that can turn herbs into drugs for the benefit of the people. He said it's in his interest that the company and the state government come together to make Kogi one of the most powerful states in Nigeria through healthcare and technology, where drones can deliver to the most remote area in Nigeria. If we want to do anything in Africa, the first place we have to start is the state of Kogi in the Federal Republic of Nigeria. And you have to be willing. <laughs> and not just starting in Kogi state. But the people of Koki State, these are what they need. Are you open? Are you willing? If in a sense of distribution, to build a distribution center in Koki State, that beginning with the nine states that surround Koki State, that Koki State can begin to supply those states. His answer to me was, I am willing. The president and CEO of Saivat Pharmaceutical Company, Lenzi Davis, commended Governor Bello for the invitation and hospitality. He said his organization is in Kogi to bring development in agriculture, technology, manufacturing, and to educate people on how to prevent sickle cell. We'd like to thank uh, the governor for inviting us. Uh, since we've been here, um, uh, we've been treated uh, I should say excellently. <laughs> Thank the governor for that. But our goal was coming here to get an idea how we can really help Cookie State, how we can really help uh, Cookie State develop, you know, agriculture, develop uh, technology as far as with um, developing uh, vaccines, developing uh, other type of, um, you know, medicine. Uh, we also uh, have a sickle cell uh, rapid test, which some of the technology that we have with our team, you know, we believe that we'll be able to help monitor some of the sickle cell and help save lives and, you know, with, uh, and give more edu education to how to, you know, prevent the sickle cell. He noted although the company was in Africa some 30 years back, he was optimistic that this period will be different owing to the energy, relationship and what he has been told about the governor's leadership acumen. You know, with our technology, our commitment to is really to help you, you know, do what you already started to do, but do it in a such a way that Nigeria can be a country when it comes to technology, when it comes to agriculture, when it comes to, you know, manufacturing, you know, product that can be the center to ch shipping product within Africa and then all over the world. The delighted Governor Yahya Bello said that Kogi State was on a path of development as it continued to witness business interest from internationals. He assured them that their personnel, investments, and every other thing shall be adequately secured. We're doing our best to ensure that education, health, agriculture, other infrastructures are being put in place within the limit of our resources. So, you are coming at a good time. That we are taking the state from the scratch, then it means we shall build together and grow together. Governor Bello promised to give them the necessary cooperation to ensure that they invested safely in a bid to further encourage other investors into the state and that his government is doing its best in health, education and agriculture by putting in place the needed infrastructures. He advised that despite their interest in profit making, they should ensure that they give their host communities a sense of ownership adding that there will be a nexus between the state government and the United States business community. This can happen. I believe in my capacity, in our capacity, 
and we can make it happen. The Commissioner for Finance, Budget and Economic Planning, Asiwaju Asiru Idris, also commended the investors and thanked the government of Delaware for giving recognition to the youngest governor of the state. Knowing, looking at what the governor has been doing in Kogi State, where they can see, and it's also in line with what he is doing as the executive of Camp Newcastle, that they believe they can set aside a day for Governor Yabilu in Newcastle. And, and on that, they declare November 19 every year as Governor Yayabelo Day in Newcastle in the US. <laughs> that alone shows that uh, we are dealing with the right people. Saivad is a United States-based billion-dollar company that came to Kogi State with plans to establish a world-class pharmaceutical industry, agricultural and other allied industries in the Confluence State with a plan to commence operation in no distance time. Khadijat Mohammed, reporting for MLC TV.